welcome back to my channel welcome back to another vlog so it's wednesday mm. it's 9 one and right now i'm just waiting for my nephew because he's gonna be here for the day so i've been up at, since like 7 30 i think 7 15 7 30 and Yes, yeah, I'm checking my emails. Um, I was just like cleaning up and stuff. I was sleeping outside of our house because I haven't done it. <laughs> so we had like pine needles from our Christmas tree, like on our steps, and just like leaves. It was just giving real ghetto. So I had to sweep that up. Like my mom would be like, "Girl, what?" My mom would be pissed if she saw that. Which she, I don't, she has seen it. Maybe she just hasn't paid attention to it. But my mom is like really like not anal, but like she don't like it to be like the um what's it called like the flyers and what's why am I blanking on what the uh I'm blanking circulars. Yeah, she don't like circulars on people's porch. Like, she'll clean it up off of her porch, like, immediately. She don't like flyers from, like, pizza stores, anything like that, in the door and stuff. And she's always, like, sweeping up, like, inside the house, outside the house. So, like, if you saw my house out there, like I said, what she has, you know, mm, I knew better than that. Because what? Since December, that's trifling. And then all of the fall leaves and stuff. So, it was just a mess. Yeah, I know my neighbors aren't going to do it because we have like a shared step. So I just did it because it was really bothering me. So yeah, other than that, I haven't been doing much this morning. Um, what else did I do? I slept in here also just because he's about to be running back and forth in here. And I meant to do it last night, but I forgot because I definitely cleaned my house last night. I don't know if y'all could tell, but I definitely cleaned up, made sure the dishes were running in a dishwasher. You know, all that boring stuff. But yeah. Anyway, welcome to the vlog. I was just reading y'all comments from last week's vlog. <laughs> y'all are so funny. And let me see. One of my babes said, she was like, I figured out what you're not trying to say. <laughs> Which is so funny because I thought I was being discreet, but I guess not. It's not really like a big secret or anything, but it's just so funny that she said that. But yeah, I'm about to start replying to all y'all comments this is my favorite part like this is all i care about is just talking to y'all so i'm about to do that once he comes and yeah so we're gonna go to the zoo i think i'm about to buy the tickets for 12 so isaiah was supposed to come with us but now he has a meeting at 12 30 so he was like asking if we go like 1 32 but i think that's just too late because like i don't know what time my sister is coming to get my nephew um after she gets off of work so i don't want to like risk it like be rushing at the zoo or don't have enough time or like so yeah because she usually doesn't really know what time because she usually works from home but certain days or sometimes she goes in so this is like the rare occasion that she goes in it's kind of like once a month she goes into the office so usually she comes to pick him up around like four ish but it's not like guaranteed so i don't want to like not have him have fun at the zoo because we got a rush because his mom's about to come you know what i mean so it's just gonna be me and him i'm ready let me show you the outfit so i had a whole different outfit planned girl it was remember i was saying how it was supposed to be real hot today or whatever it is not looking like that it's looking like um it's like 63 right now which isn't bad but it was supposed to be hot Er, than that. It's not really gonna get hot until like five. Now I'm trying to be back in the house by then, so I had to scrap that outfit. But what I'm gonna wear is just this skim shirt. I'm gonna be plain Jane. And remember, I was saying I had got these sweatpants from Essentials, and they were too big, and I was gonna take them to my lady. Um, I just tried them on, and I don't know if it's because I have on these leggings, but. They fit, they're baggy, but they fit. And I don't know if it's because I had the leggings one underneath or what. But I'm just going to have to try to make them work because these are like the only, these look so wide. 
the only clean sweatpants that I really have. Like I did laundry just now and tried to like wash some stuff and now our dryer isn't working. It was working, then it stopped, and now it's not working again. I don't know what the heck is going on, but I don't got time. And it's not that serious because I'm just going to the zoo. So, yeah. My cousin, my god sister, she's coming. I got to go pick her up from school, though. So, because I think her college already has spring break, so she's at school. But she said she could, uh, she wasn't doing nothing, so she's going to come. Let me see what these pants look like now that I don't got those on. It's not the worst. It's just that crotch look a little funny. But whatever. I'm not even going to do no makeup today. I'm going to do some probably concealer and stick some lashes on. I forgot to get my tweezers. Stick some lashes on. You turn the volume up on the, I don't know if this TV or the iPad or what. Every time he come over here, he watches that Blue Clues movies. And now it's like, it's like, that movie, yeah, that's what it is. It's drilled into my head. What was I about to do? Let me get my tweezers real quick. Why, turn that down a little bit. All right. O O T Z. Can y'all see? No. Not that it's anything anyway. But yeah. White is in the bathroom. And then once he's finished, we're going to leave. We got to leave right now, to be honest. We got like an hour to get there, but I still got to get my guy's sister. So yeah, let me see if he's almost finished. I packed up this bag, his snacks and stuff. If you got it, it ain't a question. Shout out to the moms because I had my nephew for like hours, seven hours or so. Dream me. The zoo was a zoo. First of all, I forgot that it's spring break. Pet. Pet. I mean like pet. And it just Philly. I haven't been to the zoo in a couple years. I went probably like back in like 2015. It was like a double date with me and Isaiah and my brother and whatever girl he was talking to at the moment. And it was cute. It was cute. Girl, the animals, I guess they were sick. I don't know. But there was like no animals. There was no elephants, no. We didn't see tigers. We didn't see. Basically, all we saw was giraffes. And some two puny behind, sickly looking behind lions. Like, I'm talking bony. Like, girl, mm mm. No, Philly, you gotta do better. Because I don't know what the hell I. Girl. No, just a no. So, next time, the next activity is either gonna be we going to the aquarium or we going to the park to have a picnic because. I'm not paying for the zoo when you don't got no animals. Girl. No. No. And then got the nerve to be asking for donations when you buy the tickets. But my god sister was like, they probably want the donations so they can get more animals. I don't know what y'all want the donations for. But listen, it's not, no, it's not giving. That's very disappointing because I used to love going to the zoo when I was little. Like, I used to go to the zoo all the time. But... Why you have fun? All he really cared about was his phone. Like, as long as he has his phone, he don't care what's going on. So, yeah, it's what time is it? It's six fourteen. I'm about to finish watching Love Is Blind. I'm on episode four. It's boring. 
Like, I don't know what Netflix is. I don't know what's going on, but it's, it's boring. It's dry. Like, I turned it off to watch, um, what was that show I was talking about earlier? The Francesca show. Perfect match? No. I turned it off to watch that, and now I'm like circling back since I finished that. And it's just, just like, it's boring. Mm -hmm. And it's cringy too. Like, y'all ever can't watch something because it just makes you like physically cringe? Yeah. Anyway, my bowl mm, about to bust is white rice, pencil beans. I get either or. I get either pencil beans or black beans, but this time I got pencil. Chicken. Extra fajitas. Corn sour cream, cheese, and lettuce. And it hit every time. Two vinaigrettes every time. Guac and chips every time. Babe, your soda is up here. Okay, come on in. And a Sprite. You coming up here? Yeah. Mm. You finished? Yeah. I still got more, but I still got one of that. Here. I'm about to watch my show. You said you got to watch the show? Okay. I'm about to lay down and watch the show with you. the last vlog saying that we got some stuff or whatever got some loser or whatever or i tell you yesterday was a complete turnaround like <laughs> it's just so crazy how i don't know it's just crazy how like i was about to say life but not even life like we just have good days and bad days like it's i don't i don't even know how to explain that but like yesterday was just filled with like all this good news like isaiah got great news at work my niece got her permit on the first try and y'all kiss is sponsoring me and it came through yesterday like what y'all know i do my nail videos and y'all know like my nail videos have the most views on my TikTok. Like, if you follow me on TikTok, you know my nail videos are, like, um, some of the videos that have, like, my highest views. And I was, like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, I just would buy press-ons, and then I started doing TikTok. And I just, one day, was, like, filming a daily vlog back when I was living in the DMV. And I just so happened to do my nails that day with a pair of the Kiss Press-On nails. And like everyone in the comments was like, show us how you do your nails. Like I didn't even think anything of it. I was just filming throughout my day. Like I didn't even think anyone would like notice that I was doing my nails. Like I don't know how to explain it. Like I didn't think that that video would become anything. But the girlies were asking like, show us how you do your nails. Cause it was only like probably like no more than like like a 10 second clip of me doing my nails and then from there i started doing the nail tutorials and y'all know i never stopped and so that was like what two years ago i would say two years 
or three years i don't even know how long that's been not three maybe two years and now they're sponsoring me they reached out and remember i was talking about how some brands like they'll either like have a set rate for you and then you can negotiate or they ask you your rate so they asked me my rate plus they asked me what i would charge for them to have usage rights on my video and everything and girl they accepted my rate and it's just so crazy that like everything comes full circle like i never i wasn't doing those videos to ever get sponsored by them and people will comment on tiktok and be like kiss needs to sponsor you kiss needs to sponsor you and they would be tagging kiss in my comments and kiss never like they never like ever commented on my video or nothing until i want to say maybe like last month the kiss tiktok commented on one of my nail videos and said either put like an emoji or something and then that was that not a month later they're sponsoring me like that's crazy i feel like that's all on the tiktok girlies like i feel like the tiktok girlies manifested that for me because i didn't care to get sponsored by them i just like the nails and y'all know i don't get my nails done how crazy is that i'm so excited so yeah great news that's so crazy that's like really a full circle moment anyway new perfume <laughs> Like, at this point, it's not even a video if I don't show perfume, I feel like. Like, this is my life now. Nails and perfume, I guess. So, Juliet has again launched a new perfume. This is Lust for Sun. This is, like, for summertime. This is the big body. This is a 3.3 fluid ounce. Twisted Lily sent me this. And it launches today. So, I can talk about it. But by the time y'all would have seen it, it would have been out already, obviously. But... I can post it on my story today. So, if you're interested in it, if you like Juliet Has a Gun, like if you like all of her other flinkers, we about to see what this one is giving. Is it giving fragrance of the summer or is it giving flop? I love Juliet's packaging, how it comes in like this styrofoam box. All of her fragrances come in this box. I know I only have one of her fragrances, and I have, I think it's Lipstick Diva, and it's like a raspberry scented fragrance, and I was telling y'all that I liked it at the time, like I loved it, and now it's like more of a light. Okay, bottle, this is pretty. It's so pretty, and the light, you can see like how ombre it is. Mm, that's so cute. Where the notes at before we smell it? Yeah, let's read the description. So it says, a Minoe and coconut veil layering on a white flowery cocktail. Yulang Yulang, orange blossom, gardenia. Lust for sun, it makes you dive straight into summer. And old to the holidays in its solar aura. So, Yulang Yulang, orange blossom, gardenia. You got me at orange blossom because y'all know I was just talking about orange blossom. Wait, why? <laughs> I cannot open this. Hold on. I feel like I'm messing the bottle up on my fingerprints. Mm, hold it. This smells like this. Y'all see how that like just sprays out? It's almost like a continuous mist. Alright, y'all dragging it now. This is so good. Wait, 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 wait. This smells like, this smells so familiar. I don't know what, and not like a fragrance that I have, but like, a person? Like, who does this smell like? The thing that's sticking out to me is the gardenia. I feel like that's like a top, 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 like maybe first note. That's something I'm getting first. It's giving like really pretty white floral. 
with like a touch of coconut like you could wear this either like to like a garden in the spring or like the beach like it's like you took a garden and the beach and like meshed them together but what i'm about to do right now is what i'm about to do <laughs> i'm about to make a list of everything that we need from the grocery stores so Trader Joe's, giant also i think i need to go to bj's not even i think i think i kind of have to so i was doing inventory and we are out of a lot of stuff isaiah was saying he's out of a lot of stuff so i'm about to just make a list of everything from each place from each supermarket so that it's organized and i'm not just going in with just vibes like that's not no that's not what it's giving it's giving stick to the list and get the hell out of there so let me do that right now drink my smoothie and yeah i was watching the news yesterday not yesterday this morning and philly <laughs> it's about to give all summer that's all i'm gonna say y'all i'm watching love is blind i just had to submit my video concept for kiss so after i ate those wings which yeah those are my favorite wings in the entire world but i ate my food and then i had to submit that content by the end of the day today so one of the content the content concept so hopefully they agree with the concept because, I don't know, I basically just explained like what I do for all of my nail videos, so, I don't know. Because they were saying they wanted like a get ready with me slash application process slash trend, what did they say? Trend something, which I didn't know what that meant. Trend, um, let me see. Trend focused content. I guess meaning like trendy. I don't know. I only really try to do trendy things. I don't know. Hopefully they accept it though. I feel like my camera is kind of blurry. Oh my god, my hair looks a mess. I don't know why my hair did not straighten well. No, I know why. <laughs> I was chatting with my sister and my hair was drying. What I need to do is like as soon as I got the shower, I need to straighten my hair. I need to blow dry it because if I don't blow dry it right away when it's still wet, um, my curls kind of set and my roots are like i don't know how to explain it like my roots my curls especially like for my roots get really really tightly like coiled and then it's hard for me to like straighten them so i need to like do it quick while it's still wet otherwise it just it ends up kind of like not the best when it's straightened hanging on my neck Race of matches is set. My brother name is Ting the Dollar. Stop all that back and forth over the net. 
My mama wish I would've went corporate, she wish I would've went exec. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec. Cherie, boy, I'm on back. They only giving niggas plus one, so I never pull up to the map. You know I gotta bring the set. You know I gotta bring the G block. You know I gotta bring the D block. Cause you know how sticky it get. Hey. 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 She put me in a play with that cat. Hey. She love how I make it away. Hey. You know how sticky it get. Hey. Hey, yo, Eric. Bring them girls to the stage. Cause somebody's getting paid. And free big slime out the cage. And Shorty try to play it cool. But now she wish she would've stayed. Cause every song that I make.
one yesterday, right before I started cleaning, like when I was out doing some errands and stuff, my period came on. So, yeah, that was fun, cleaning while you were just starting your period. So, it wasn't too bad yesterday though, but like today it's been like really, really bad. But anyway, let's try this. I don't even know what this is called. What are they calling it? I think she calls it, the original creator calls it the TikTok. What is it? This, I don't know. Some type of snack, her favorite snack. And I'm gonna link her video below. But I'm so excited. I'm so hungry. So I think I'm gonna use one. Ew, something in here felt fuzzy. Yeah, one of the peppers is like almost done. I'm gonna use one yellow, one red, one orange, right? Is that enough? I'll just do one more yellow and see. This better be good. I promise you. And maybe that's why I started craving it because it came up on my timeline. And I think it came on my timeline Thursday night, so like right before my period came on yesterday, Friday. So maybe I just was having like a period craving and now I'm like, I have to try this to satisfy my craving. I don't need to shake it, it's okay. It's almost done. I already cooked my rice and stuff, so I have to just season it with butter some salt some pepper and cilantro so let me cut these cucumbers and stuff and peppers up but yeah so isaiah's sister is coming i think i told y'all i don't know if i did so we're gonna go pick her up on monday and i gotta show you all the stuff that i got yesterday while well, doing my errands. But that'll be after I eat. That's the reason why I haven't ate anything. It's 6.45. Right. I just don't have an appetite. Like when my period comes on and I have to like force myself to eat. So. It definitely tastes like something that you would get at like hibachi or benihana. And you're just supposed to, or she doesn't measure anything. And I like a lot of sauce, so yeah, that might be too much. And then your little chili crunch. How do you expect me to open it? thing about this is that I hate that it be like oil like I'm not trying to be sipping oil let's do two of these this looks so good it does yeah I give her that it does look good but does it taste good But the bagel, I'm not gonna do too much of this because it has salt in it, and I don't, I don't really like to put too much salt in my food. All right, let's try it. My salmon is almost ready. Oh, it's over. That's look good though. All right, let's get. Peppers, cucumbers. I want to make sure I get the sauce. All right, this is a crazy bite.
wrong, but... It's not... Like, I don't get, like, the height. Like, it's okay. Would I make it again? Yeah. If I have the ingredients, but I'm not gonna go my way to get the ingredients. Like, when I run out of the peppers, I'm not gonna go get some more. You know what I mean? Good. The ginger dressing is crazy. Avocado. It's perfect too. Like perfect, perfect, perfect. Mm. I'm gonna put some yum yum sauce on it. crazy it looks a mess i don't care mm -hmm. let me go eat my food let me text isaiah to come get his easter happy easter if you celebrate easter you already know i said easter is one of my favorite holidays but i'm not doing anything today but i do have to go to the airport pick up my cousin and then just come back home but I, like, I don't know, like, it's just so weird to spend these holidays not doing anything. Because then it doesn't actually feel like the holiday, you know what I mean? But anyway, girl, I have a little haul before we end this vlog. And then I'm going to start the next week's vlog tonight. So, let's start with, um, let's start with the Amazon stuff. So, the project, the girls is back from Caddy Project. So I went to Target the other day. Remember I was telling y'all I, I had some runs to do on Friday. And my period came on. Yeah, I went to Target. <laughs> and I, girl, Target had khakis. And these were $3. I took the tag off. But these were in the bullseye section. And they were $3 each. And they had light pink ones. And then they had orange ones. And then they had these white ones all the way in the back. And I was like, y'all gonna hide the nice ones. I mean, the pink ones were nice. And the orange ones were nice too, but plain Jane, like y'all know me. So I got one for each of them. And I don't know if these were like supposed to be like geared as maybe Easter baskets. I don't know because they could function as Easter baskets, but they were out with the Easter stuff. And I was like, girl, this is perfect because this is all they need. Like the ones on Amazon were like coming up like $20. $3 because these are going to be getting wet 
and like soapy and all that stuff and it's just going to be under my cabinet most of the time when they're not here so it's no reason to spend 20 each so 40 when i can spend six so um since i got those we're going to make up the baskets today yeah because the sister is coming tomorrow so i ordered their socks on amazon i got 10 of these white ones and then 10 black ones so i'm going to split them up and give them five each so five black ones and then five white ones and then um i ordered their underwear i'm not going to show the underwear but <coughs> excuse me um it's just regular you know underwear and i'm going to wash them tonight because you should always wash your underwear before you wear them and i opened it up and it smells like vinegar so i'm going to wash these tonight but <clears throat> i'll just show how they'll look in the basket i guess and then also at Target, I forgot to get shampoo, and I'm only going to make it up one basket since only one sister is coming, but I'm just going to put that shampoo that I showed on last week's vlog, the little travel size one, in her caddy for now until I can get back to Target and get them their own shampoo, but I picked up a bunch of these two, uh, two freshes from Target. I love these for guests, and of course, I had to get the white ones, so white and light gray, so you can never have too many of these. And then the little loofahs. So the older one will have the white one, and then the younger one will have the pink one. And then I just got the, the younger one, her own little toothpaste. So that's it. And then I also got this from the bullseye section. Or is it a dollar spot? What is it called now? I don't even know what it's called. But you know, the, the stuff that's like under $5 on the front. I picked this up just because I was like, this is. So cute it's five dollars and i don't know if i want to spray paint this either white or black or just leave it natural i don't know but i wanted to go into that bathroom and i'm gonna put um like some girly soap and like a girly candle on there so that yeah it's just gonna be like her bathroom for the week so i wanted to feel like i don't know how to explain it not it doesn't have to be aesthetic it just, i just wanted to be like cozy for her so We'll do that when we go in there and start putting the caddies together. What else? I need to get a comb, a brush, and some gel. I was going to get it at Target, but it was expensive at Target. I'm like, no, I'll go to the hair store. Like, no. Oh, my God. The underwear just fell. It's okay. At least I got to wash it so it doesn't matter. So, okay, what else? I went to Bath and Body Works because they were having another sale. So they were having like a buy one, get one for candles. So I got this candle and I got, where is it? Not this one. This one and this one because they had a sale, I think last month and they were like $12. So I got both of these scents for Isaiah and he loves them and they smell so good like I picked them out but like I picked them out with intentions of just having them in his office so whenever I'm in his office I'm like yo it smells so freaking good in here and it's because of these candles and I got the matching room sprays so it's just always smelling good in there so I was like I need to pick them up for like up here so I can burn them um, and not use up his so this one is Palo Santo and Sage this one smells so good and i'm now only buying the candles that look like this like in this packaging because i can't stand bath and body works packaging but this is really pretty so yes this smells so good this is sage palo santo and then amber woods so good like so 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 good and then this one is bergamot and birch and it's bergamot black amber and birch wood yeah the packaging is just so pretty the color it smells good. It smells like nice and fresh. So I figured these would be nice for him um, because they were like fresh and clean smelling and not like too feminine. But like I had to pick them up for myself because I'm like, yo, these smell so freaking good. And then I just picked up two more that I already have. This one is raspberry, raspberries and vanilla. This is pink raspberry, strawberries, strawberry, vanilla bean, and then sugar lemon drops. This one is my favorite scent of all time. At Bath and Body, I don't know why this smells so good, but it just does. 
It smells so good. It smells like, yeah, it smells like a, 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 a I was going to say a strawberry lemon drop, but it smells like a raspberry lemon drop. Like, it's so good. And this one is like my second favorite. This is pink lavender and espresso. This is a rich pink lavender, caramel espresso beans, and smooth vanilla. So pretty, and it just smells so good. Like, these two... I don't know, maybe it's just because of the color of the palette. I don't know. I they they both smell good, but they both look good too. Like love these. So I already have this one and I burned all of it because it's just so good. So this is my old one. And then I have raspberry with vanilla. It's in a different I like this packaging better, but whatever. This is my old one and then this is the new one. I like this one better the pink on gray but both are still pretty so yeah i'm only buying candles that look like this and i find that these ones smell like the best so yeah and these are my old ones what is this one um fiji white sands this one is really good this smells very like clean and beachy and spa like this is fresh cut sugar cane white nectarine and sandalwood i'm like almost finished this morning but this one is so good and then this one I'm about to burn today. This is vanilla and musk. This is with vanilla, soft cedar wood, and sweet musk. This packaging is so pretty too. So this is about to be a fresh burn, and I'm so excited. This one is stupid. So yeah. Anyway, and then I have more of like this. I don't know what this line is called. I think it's like the neutrals, but I have like a couple more in my bathroom underneath the counter because they're just too, 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 too good. All right. So, we're going to use all of the Among the Clouds, which I'm going to use mine tonight. This gives me Easter vibes. So, I'm going to just put everything, and I forgot to grab the shampoo and conditioner, but it's whatever. I also forgot to get her deodorant. I'm not going to Target today. I don't even know if Target is open today. should be, because not everybody celebrates Easter. So, should I put them in here? Or should I put the underwear? All right, I'm going to put all of the body care stuff in here. Let's see if it fits. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, that's adorable. Okay, and then, see, I need a little girl because... I like girly stuff. Um, I'm gonna put the socks. Let me see. Should I wash the socks too? I don't know. I don't think I need to wash the socks. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna only put like three, three. She shouldn't need 10 pairs of socks for the week, I don't think. So she'll have three, and then we'll save three for next time. And then, let me say two, four. Okay, so six pairs total. some of these socks because I like them so I'm gonna just stuff them in here I'm trying to see how to make this look okay and then I'm gonna is there anything else I need to put the shampoo and conditioner in here so maybe I will These are the underwear. I am think I'm, I'm gonna just stuff them over here to the side with the socks. And then, and the conditioner. Okay. So this is what it's looking like. I'm gonna have to like play around with it, but this is like, 
the concept. So the body care products, I can't believe I still have more in her voice. And then her loofah, her toothbrush, her sponge, and then all of her like undergarments and stuff. And then I'll put the shampoo and conditioner somewhere in here, probably like on the side here. But this is so cute. And I'm gonna just have it on the counter for her. And everything that she needs will just be right there for her. And then I'm thinking since the Among the Clouds has purple in it, and this is just going to be off, like, on the counter, I think I'm going to have, like, a purple theme on the counter for her, too. So this is Sweet Whiskey, even though it's whiskey, is Golden Amber, Vanilla F.U.'s Whiskey, and then Red Berries. This smells really good. I haven't used this yet, so she can try it out. Yeah, this is really good. So her hand soap. I'm gonna just put it on here and then I'm gonna put I think I'm gonna let her use this for just like hand lotion also because it's purple while I'm at it because I know I like a theme so boom and boom and then I'm gonna just have this candle on it as well kind of like that on the counter so oh this is adorable this is like <laughs> I don't know, this is so cute. Okay, so let me go put this stuff on the counter. And I gotta get the towels and stuff out the dryer. I gotta fix up in here, but yeah. That's basically it. I'm gonna show y'all how this looks on the counter. And that's it, I'm gonna see y'all next week. Happy Easter. I don't know if you're seeing this today on Sunday or tomorrow. I don't know if I'm gonna upload it on Easter. So either today or tomorrow, but I will see you next time. Love you.